Welcome one and all to Darkest Dungeon. I'm doing an OBS test with okay. op Open Broadcast Software, or OBS. Uh, the audio in the actual recording wasn't very good. And in fact, you, could bear you couldn't even hear what I was saying. So, I'm doing this. Some post-commentary. I don't think the video is too long. Let me share with you the terrible wonders I have come to know. Had my headset plugged into the wrong jack. You might hear that. In fact, you will hear that. Here, I was just trying to do just a trying to do prep. The audio is outlandishly loud as I'm saying this, so I will have to reduce the gain in it in post. So this is all I have to say on it. I'm just commenting on something I've already done, and I don't like post commentary. I don't. Yeah, I literally cannot hear my commentary over this game's audio. But I got OBS to work pretty well. I just do some... Whatever it is I'm doing, I'm gonna grab a snack. Let this play out, you can watch what I'm doing. Got some Pringles. I'm just trying to work on skills and just trying to figure out who I was going to take. And the team I chose worked out really well. And if I do say so myself. And at this point I realized I didn't have any money. Well, not quite yet. But yeah, give this game a shot. It's really good and runs... You don't need a hardcore gaming PC to run it. I have a very basic Lenovo tower and it runs it pretty solid. I do like Musketeers. They're one of my favorite units to use. Didn't have a healer, and I put the leper in the front. Lepers are actually are really powerful units. That's where I realized I had no money. And I chose to sell these. I'm not that weird satchel, and that's for my grave robber, which I don't have at this point. food. Eight is honestly a good number for a short quest. I'm going to talk directly into the microphone or else you won't hear me. But yeah, make sure you have at least eight food on a short quest with four party members. 
because they will go through food a little quite quickly if you don't. I had to click over to my other screen to check something with that. Pace out the halls of your lineage once familiar, now foreign. This is a roguelike game. So the dungeons are randomly generated, and a lot of it depends on luck. For quite a few things. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. But it's not the worst I've ever seen. God, this is loud. I got to pull the headset off my head. It is too friggin' loud. I'll worry about messing with the game's audio next time. If you want to see more of this, let me know in the comments. My whole reason for testing with OBS is so I can do more stuff on my computer. I am noticing some frame chop. Slowly, gently, this is how a life is taken. Yeah, I'm noticing quite a bit of frame chop. Executed with impunity. I did hear myself at that point. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Of course, that frame chop might just be it lagging in my editing software. I use PowerDirector 64-bit. But no, no, my Even audio is really quiet. Stone seems bent and in, on stare in mono for some reason. But yeah, I honestly don't know what's up with my audio in this. I mean, it sounds... I mean, it's clear, it sounds fine, but it's just in mono for some reason. I don't know why. I had both mics on. I'll have to fiddle around with my OBS settings. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Frame chop is very brief. And honestly, it looks like my recording software is lagging over anything else. So editing software. Time to perform beyond one's limits. Man, 
have something to do with freaking Discord being open. I can faintly hear myself. Like I said, I don't know why it's in mono. I'm doing the post in stereo so you can actually hear what I'm saying. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm self-taught in all this. Press doing it on my own. Give them no quarter. Yeah, I found I got a disease charm, so I forget who I put that on. I think I put it on Dismas here. Uh, yes. And you got another torch and some extra money. You can never bring too many torches with you to a dungeon crawl. I'm gonna say that right now. When you run out of torches, bad things can happen. Of course, good things can happen too. It's a risk-reward system. <laughs> Empty sack is very disappointing, and that's the hunger mechanic. That's why you bring food with you, because your party members get hungry. That little black ring around their head, that is stress. If your party members get too stressed, very bad things can happen. Yeah, Clotter's pretty good. You want a deal. You're gonna want to deal with those, these ladies here. Just, just, now she's being pretty stupid. I ain't gonna complain, but that's bad news. Very bad news. Such a terrible assault cannot be left Don't like Chris. I mean, I like when I get crits. I don't like when they get crits. Doesn't look like this goes for too much longer. You know, Finale does a lot of damage and puts your gesture in the back. But it can, but it will cripple your gesture, so you gotta be careful when you use it and hold the gesture forward. A death by inches. Continually onslaught. Yeah, that's just my friggin' them. You're not gonna see the stag. You shouldn't see the staggering. That's just my editing software lagging behind. Great is the weapon that cuts off. 
on its own. There is a little battle here. Three little skellies aren't much of a threat. They're more annoying than anything. I don't I don't know what I'm gonna sure I can talk about. The blood quickens. Back to the pit. And they're dead. Again. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. There's things in a comic foil doing a series on this. Check that guy out. A powerful blow. Shit, I'll, I'll, put, I'll put a link in the description and I'll have a in screen indentation for him. It doesn't look like this goes on for too much longer. Dogs barking at out there. I'll check that in a little bit. Confidence oh, surges no as the enemy crumbles. Really didn't want that to miss. As the fiend falls. Okay, the problematic the one died. Blossoms. Mortality Crit, clarified bad, in a single strike. Dismiss was trying to hang on here. And that's why you have that skill. It is so good. I just want to get rid of that damn archer in the back. And he's dead. All this up is this one problematic prick, and he's down back inside his grave. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Secrets and there's where my torch went out. Found in the most tenebrous corners of this place. I ran out of torches and I'm just praying to God that I don't get jumped. And God answered my prayers because I didn't get jumped.
shifted corridors and sloped walls of our ancestry are beginning to feel familiar. At the end of the game, sometimes they get new quirks. Fear of the unholy, that's not a very good one, but it's not terrible, it's manageable. Weld Explorer, replace the scouting chance, and he got Spasm of the Entrails, which is basically he got the shits. And the Yips, minus five accuracy. Return to town! Is alive with wild merriment and yeah there's not much longer in this another a cut like three minutes left and thanks to that little whatever it was announcement all treatment is free and that guy's missing actually I think the musketeers a woman yeah she's out on a drunken vendor Shelly back Get rid of Spasma the Entrails. Now I want to get rid of his weak grip. Get him a nice cold drink. Get other sanitarium. I got my other two parties in the sanitarium. Although this person will only gamble. So, pulling you out of the gambling hall. Putting you in. I mean, it's free, so it doesn't cost me a damn thing. And that's all there was to it. And she has that Tipler. Hellions are pretty badass. I'm going to say that right now. I like Hellions. Yeah, I got here. I'm saying I pointed out I got an abomination. They're basically werewolves. They're really good, so I go looking through all my party members and pick out who I'm going to get rid of. I sent, sent that one away, and I sent elsewhere. the Antiquarian away. Get we have lost. Need of sterner stock. Abominations Tortured. are just really good. Exclusive. This man is more dangerous than he seems. Yes. I was pointing out that he has access to all his abilities because they're split down the middle. When he transforms, he gets new abilities, and they're very powerful. Problem is, be careful when you transform because it causes stress. Here I pick out my strongest character who I can actually use. Or I can actually work on anyway. And work on her at Halberd. But that's about all I did.